What's going on guys, Tyler here and welcome back to another match day vlog. For the first time at the Valley today, Cholton will take on Accrington Stanley. Accrington Stanley? Who are they? I'm sorry, I saw an opportunity to put in the joke and I seized it. It will never, I'll never do it again. It'll be the first and only time I'll ever put it on this YouTube channel. I'm sorry, Accrington fans, I'll never do it again. So coming into this game, Accrington sits in 14th place, having won five games away from home. So their away record's pretty decent. However, they are winless in their last three, having lost two and drawn one. They drew last time out to Bristol Rovers by 0-0. Meanwhile, Cholton are unbeaten in their last three with two wins and a draw, having one last time out emphatically 3-0 against Shrewsbury. And it could have been about six or seven. But honestly, things are just going brilliantly down at Cholton right now. Everyone's performing well. Today will be the first time me seeing Ben Perrin in action. I don't think Chris Maxwell is going to start, though, the new keeper. I think Phillips might get over him in the team. As well as the return of George Lapsley, Ben Reeves and Josh Cullen from injury. Cullen we've missed for, since like November so it's brilliant to see those players back and right at the start of the season when we took on Accrington in August the game ended a 1-1 draw but for some reason I'm feeling very overconfident today and I think it's going to be a completely different story I genuinely think Cholton are going to win 3-0 again I don't know why we just seem to be in good form everything's going right at the moment everyone's playing well injuries are coming back which is even better news and honestly, I can't wait for today. I'm so confident. I think we're going to get the exact same result as we did last time. Accrington, they're going to present a physical test. They've got some decent players. Sean McConville and Billy Key. Um, also, they brought in a new player called Janoy Donacien. I've definitely butchered that name. But uh, he's a new signing, so he might get a start today. But honestly, I think Cholton are going to have a great game today. And they're going to win 3-0. But let's just hope they can do the talking on the pitch. And for the first time at the Valley, let's take down Accrington. Come on, your heads! Move seats for today's game. I hope it should be a good atmosphere. One change to the side that thrashed Shrewsbury. Josh Cullen returns to the side. Replacing Owen Morgan from injury. And Billy Clark does not feature on the bench. This could be his time at Cholton done. Wilberforce Ockren comes onto the bench from the academy. For Accrington, Sean McConville and Billy Key both start. They've got a solid team. But hopefully Cholton can get off to, can keep the momentum going and take down Accrington for the first time at the Valley. Come on, you Reds! First opening minutes and it's not been the best of starts for Cholton. Accrington seem to have control of this game in the opening minutes. They've been getting forward the most. Cholton well, haven't, haven't actually had an attack yet. So let's just hope that we can ease our way into the game because at the minute Accrington are on top by a long way. Come on Cholton. Jesus, Cholton just come close. Josh Cullen played in a fantastic ball down the wide fan Taylor. Used his strength, pulled it back across the box and I think it was either Ben Perrin and Darren Prattley just missed at the back post or didn't even get a touch to it. It's our best chance in the game so far. We're starting to wake up. Come on, Charlton. Oh my word, Jesus. Uh, something that we've struggled to do quite a lot this year. Uh, not the best. Jesus. Jesus Christ, this is a shocking man, honestly. Accrington should have gone one new up there. Our defence was shocking, they had so much room with their attack and the cross isn't winning the ball. The cross come in, had a shot, it's come to their other player, and Dylan Phillips, honestly, he's pulled off a cracking save. It's a bit of a scrap, a bit of like a fumble and scrap in the box, and Phillips has won it. Saved this big time there. Accrington probably should have scored. They've been the better team this first half, in my opinion, if I'm honest. Charlton haven't been good enough. Need to build the attack going, nearing the, nearing the uh, half-time now. 
They haven't been good enough, nowhere near the side we saw last weekend. Need to improve this big time. Come on, Charlton. Right, so it's half time here at the Valley. Charlton are playing nil, Akron's and Stanley nil. And if I'm going to be honest with you, I am bored to death. This game has been bloody <laughs> shocking. Charlton have been, well, we've not been playing well at all. We've been very poor. Accrington, we made them look like the better side. To be honest with you though, Accrington, they're not mugs. 14th in the league and they're playing well, although they have had, well, one shot on target. There's only been one shot on target in the whole game and that's come from them. They've had more shots and they're dangerous. Dylan Phillips, honestly, has saved us. That's, that chance where he saved us was ridiculous. And seriously, we need to improve badly because we've not been good enough. The only player that I can really see is trying to do stuff is Naby Sai. He's trying to ping balls across the box. It worked a couple of times at the start of the game, but it's just not working now. And at the moment, it's not going well. We've been playing badly, and it's almost the case of next goal wins. Whoever gets the goal will be in control. And at the moment, it looks like it's going to be Accrington. We've not been good enough at the moment, and we need to improve badly. Because seriously, I'm bored out of my mind. I'm going to move back to the J block because uh, the atmosphere where I've been sitting is poor. I tried to find a better camera angle by sitting there, but yeah, the atmosphere is not good over there. So I'm going to go back to my normal seat. Uh, well, hopefully there's better atmosphere and the fans are going to get behind the team because right now they need it because we've been absolutely shocking. It's been bloody boring. certainly come alive this second half, I'll tell you that. Creating a lot more chances than we did first half, much more, much better improvement. I'd say it is still quite even though, Accrington getting their chances off, but yeah, could be better, but we're getting our attacking, attacking, attacks going, but we're getting there. Come on, Charlton. How's it going? No? Little training ground. Will it pay off those? Bill Williams. Decent. Oh, 
and Taylor both been sent off. I don't know, man. It was mad, but it happens every single time. Every time we have a corner, Taylor's on the key, but he gets a foul for it. Every time. It's ridiculous. Now we've got to bring on a striker, and Accrington need to change keeper. Ridiculous. I can't look, I can't watch this. Come on, Carla, please. Come on, Carla. out to Christian Balik for taking a fan's foot straight to the nuts. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs>